for the deep squat kegel reverse kegel breathing you're going to sit down as low as you can you can obviously hold on to something if you need to but you're going to inhale and exhale one of the things that's really, really helpful here is to have some type of tactile feedback for your pelvic floor. So even though it may seem strange, reach down and feel like you're filling your hand up as you exhale and drop that pelvic floor down. This is so important. You have to be able to inhale and drop, inhale and expand that balloon so the pelvic floor and the diaphragm, and then exhale and brace everything down. So squeeze like you're trying to hold your bladder, and then inhale and exhale back and forth in this controlled manner.